Chapter 1. Introducing the Lazy Slob's Cookbook. Are you exasperated laboring for hours in the kitchen, striving to craft a sumptuous meal? Well, let your worries fade away as I present to you the ultimate solution. The Lazy Slob's Cookbook features simple yet scrumptious recipes, distinctly designed in five steps, promoting the use of affordable or readily available household items. So, get ready to embrace this culinary adventure. Grab your chef's hat, let's dive into the world of easy, delightful cooking. Chapter 2. Lazy Slob Blackened Salmon First up on our menu, we present this delectably simple dish. The cooking process is as effortless as counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Step 1. Place salmon fillet on a toaster tray, followed by a quick spray of oil as step 2. Strap 3. Give it a good sprinkle of Old Bay seasoning. For step 4, bake your salmon in the toaster for 25 minutes at a temperature of 400 degrees. The final step, step 5. Indulge in your culinary masterpiece like a true lazy slob. Chapter 3. Lazy Reuben, aka Deli Delight for the Disinterested. Next on our lazy menu is this delightful dish. The first step is to toast two slices of bread until they're crispy enough to mask their supermarket sauce. Following that, on a meticulously stack your pastrami, sauerkraut and provolone, like a well-shuffled deck of cards. The third step to microwave this stack for precisely 90 seconds. Watch as the cheese embarks on an illusion of disappearance. The fourth step lavishly spread Thousand Island dressing on both slices of your crisply toasted bread. Finally, drain any residual liquid from the plate and then effortlessly slide this tantalizing assembly between the slices of bread. If any tidbit tumbles off, consider it a bonus snack for later. Chapter 4. Lazy Nachos, aka Cheese Avalanche on a Chip Mountain. Next up on our laissez-faire culinary journey, we're diving headfirst into the galaxy of lazy nachos. Step 1. Scatter mini tacos like you're dealing cards at a high-stakes poker match. Step 2. Initiate a cheese snowstorm. Focus on even distribution, not precision. Step 3. Drown them in taco sauce like you're extinguishing a small fire. Take note, this is food artistry, not physics lecture. Step 4. Heat in the microwave until the cheese appears to have surrendered to existence. And for the grand finale, Step 5. Devour with the zeal of discovering a life-saving oasis in a barren desert. And there you go, friends. A relaxed yet tantalizing delight that's prepared quicker than you can utter delicioso. Chapter 5. Lazy Shepherd's Pie, aka Casserole of Convenience. Next up, we showcase our iconic dish. Your mission begins with browning some ground beef in a pan. Listen for the sizzle. That's your clue that you're on the right track. For step two, introduce a can of mixed veggies to the mix, purely for health reasons, of course. That step three requires a blanket of instant mashed potatoes. You heard it right, instant. Let's face it, we're not in a Michelin star kitchen. For step four, treat it like a snowy day and grate some cheese on top. Finally, step five, slide it the oven and bake until the cheese turns a beautiful golden shade or whenever it dawns upon you that you've got something baking. But chapter six, lazy pad thai. Next up is the couch potato solution to Asian cuisine, our very own lazy pad thai. Step one, commence by boiling water. Envision it like you're creating a mini hot spring in the heart of your kitchen. Step two, gently pour it into a cup of instant ramen. Imagine you're forming a protective moat around an intricate sandcastle. Step three, blend in a spoonful of peanut butter. Step four, infuse with squirt of soy sauce and one squirt of sriracha sauce. Step five, stir it up with a fork to blend all the flavors together, then consume it with the eagerness of a gastronome making their way through a bustling street food festival. Chapter seven, lazy breakfast burrito. Do you fancy a quick breakfast with fantasies of dining on the beach of Los Cabos? Try this breakfast burrito. Start off by scrambling an egg in a microwave-safe bowl and then microwave for 60 to 90 seconds, stirring halfway through. Step two, lay a flour tortilla on a plate and sprinkle shredded cheese in the middle. Step three, place the scrambled egg on top of the cheese. Step four, add a spoonful of salsa or hot sauce over the egg. Lastly, in step five, roll up the tortilla into a burrito and relish a quick breakfast. Chapter eight, lazy caprese salad. Want to impress you with minimal effort? How about whipping up a lazy caprese salad? Step one, slice a large tomato and slice fresh mozzarella cheese. Step two, arrange the tomato and mozzarella slices alternately on a plate. Step three, drizzle with balsamic glaze and olive oil. Step four, sprinkle with salt, pepper and dried basil. 
You can use the leftover packets of salt and pepper in your drawer from your last fast food french fry order. Step 5. Serve as a no-fuss, elegant appetizer or side dish. Chapter 9. Lazy chocolate mug cake, aka dessert for the desperate and for our sweet ending, we have the lazy chocolate mug cake. Your first task? Empty the cake mix and water into a mug. Stir it up with the energy of a laid-back sloth. Up next, microwave until you notice it rise up, much like your aspirations on a casual Friday night. Moving on, let it cool off or choose not to. I don't care, you do you. Dare to be different, it's your call. Task four, garnish with whatever you've got in the fridge, whipped cream, ice cream, a solo cherry. The final step, devour it directly from the mug to avoid extra dishwashing. You can thank me later. Chapter 10, lazy barbecue. Chicken, AKA saucy bird for the slackful. Searching for a speedy fix? Try the lazy barbecue chicken. First step, position chicken breasts in a baking dish. There's no need to be elaborate, they're indifferent. Second step, submerge them in barbecue sauce as if you are concealing incriminating clues. Third step, envelop with foil. Imagine it's like tucking them in for a nighttime snooze. Fourth step, bake until they're done or until you can't resist the smell anymore. Final step, serve with a side of, I totally labored over this. Chapter 11. Lazy Banana Smoothie, aka Fruit Swell for the Unswirled. For those couch potatoes who aspire to create a mirage of being healthy and fitness aware, give this Lazy Banana Smoothie a shot. Step 1. Toss a banana, some yogurt and a hint of milk into a blender. Step 2. Press blend and watch it whirl as your head does on a Monday morning. Step 3. Decant it into a glass or not. Savor it straight from the blender. We're not the judgmental type. Step four, introduce a straw for that dash of elegance. Step five, take a leisurely sip and pretend you're on a health kick. Chapter 12, conclusion. And there you have it, folks. We've come to the end with a sneak peek into the Lazy Slobs cookbook. With these easy to follow recipes, even the laziest slobs can enjoy delicious meals without any hassle. So go ahead, embrace your inner lazy slob and let the, the culinary journey begin. If you like this video, do us a favor and leave a comment, hit the like button and subscribe.